Hello and welcome to my second video. Today I'm going to share with you how to edit eyes in Lightroom. So stick with me just a couple minutes and I will show you two different ways to edit eyes using only Lightroom. Method number one is for when you're much closer and you can see the details of the iris. Okay, so we're gonna start with this picture of Allie here. Um, here's the original from camera. She already has like beautiful blue eyes, so it won't take much editing. Anyways, this is the one after doing some of the other edits and now it's just the eyes are left. All of this revolves around the adjustment brush tool, which if you watched my last video, shortcut K. So hit, hit the K button and let's start with the iris. So all you're gonna do, choose the brush size that works for you and you're going to head over into with the adjustment brush tool you can hit O to turn on the overlay so you can see where you're painting. I'm just gonna come in here and paint around all of the iris here. Sweet, so <laughs> got the demon eyes there. Anyways, we're going to turn that off and we're going to adjust a little bit of exposure. If someone has brown eyes, you will be needing to adjust the exposure even more. Not too much, it's easy to overdo eyes here. A Little bit of contrast, there we go, there we go. I'm liking this little bit of sharpness. And I tend to desaturate a lot of my images, so it's nice to bring some of that back into the eyes. Her eyes are already pretty blue, so I'm gonna just add just a smidge more to really, really make them a vibrant blue. And Lightroom recently added an update where you can adjust the hues of the local adjustment brush. So here's me kind of messing with that. You can change, this is more of like what you could do in Photoshop, but I'm not gonna do any of that today. So this is where I'm at with the irises. So let's see what difference that made. This is before and this is after. And then we can zoom out to see that again. Here is before, here is after. Okay, sweet. So now the next step is the sclera, the whites of the eyes. So again, it's gonna go all around your adjustment brush tool. Her right eye is slightly darker than her left eye because of how I had the lighting. So I'm actually going to do two separate adjustments. This is to really bring in the whites to give that strong contrast between the iris and the uh, sclera. So I'm gonna add maybe 0.2 there, looking good. So now I'm going to do the same on the other eye, except just add less exposure when I go to make that change. <laughs> now we got the stoner eyes. Cool. So I'm gonna do the same thing, just less. So maybe about 0.1 there. Okay, what does that look like before? And there's after. Alrighty, that is looking pretty good. So now, depending on the eyes, everyone, everyone has them, are veins, blood vessels, red squiggly lines. So for that, this is totally optional, and if you really, really needed to fix something, Photoshop would be essential here, but say you just had a couple you know, things you wanted to tweak, then you could do that quickly using, again, the adjustment brush tool. This won't totally remove them, but it will make a slight change. So drop the saturation, increase the exposure. Okay, so let's see what that did. It's a very subtle change, but that's it. So the three different steps, the iris, where we're increasing the exposure slightly, the contrast, saturation, maybe switching the hue or temperature a little bit, and sharpness. Then there was the sclera where we were just brightening that up just a smidge. And then there was the vessels. Sweet. Now method number two is a lot easier. This is where you can't see the definition of the eyes. It's pretty far away, it's dark. There's no way other than really making the iris bright that you're gonna see a lot of color there. But yet we still want to brighten them up a little bit to simply bring more attention to them. So this one, we're going to use the same tool here. And this time you're going to paint all in the eye. You're not gonna worry about breaking it into the iris, into the sclera. It's just one demon eye looking brush tool. So again, exposure, contrast, sharpness. There's before and that's after. So that's it. Those are the two ways to edit eyes in Lightroom. The first one being a little bit closer where you're tweaking the iris, the sclera, 
and any vessels. And then if it's a little bit further away or you cannot see all the detail of the eye, again, you're using the local adjustment brush tool and you're only going over everything, increasing the exposure, contrast, and sharpness. That's it. Thank you so much for watching video number two and I will see you next time.